Hello, my name is Yaping Xu. I'm a postdoc research associate at the University of Tennessee, Knoxville. My topic for this poster is leaf nitrogen content modeling and rust disease detection of field-grown switchgrass with UVV-based hyperspectral imagery and machine learning. Please note that this poster was submitted for the Cotton Incorporated Early Career Research Challenge. If you are also interested in my regular poster, please check my other poster, Sustainability Trait Modeling of Field-Grown Switchgrass Using UVV-Based Imagery. The study is funded by DOE, collaborated with CBI, Oak Ridge National Lab, and supervised by Dr. Neil Stewart Jr. Switchgrass is one of the best candidate species for biofuel production. In our previous study, we explored the feasibility of applying UEV remote sensing into the high-throughput phenotyping for switchgrass. We successfully developed models for automated assessment of phenotypic and sustainability traits such as chlorophyll, nitrogen, lignin content, and rust disease, as well as biomass using UEV-based LiDAR and multispectral data. To further improve the models, we need to overcome two challenges. One, identifying plants with rust disease, which affects the sustainable growth of switchgrass. And two, we need to improve the model accuracy for nitrogen content. Therefore, in this cotton challenge poster, we are proposing two methods to address the nitrogen challenges. Method one, multispectral imagery with A, incorporating more vegetation index into the model, and B, machine learning approach. We included 10 vegetation indices into the model and tested the correlations between nitrogen content and the 10 vegetation indices calculated from multispectral imagery. As our end-of-season data do not show strong correlations between nitrogen and the vegetation indices, we proposed to use machine learning algorithms to select the best predictors as well as modeling the nitrogen content. Proposed method 2 is to include hyperspectral imagery into the nitrogen content modeling. We have in our previous study demonstrated the spectral responses for healthy switchgrass. Further analysis based on hyperspectral imagery and machine learning are ongoing. For challenge 2, we are proposing the autonomous detection for switchgrass rust disease. Specific questions need to be answered on the best spectral wavelengths or spectral bands, on what platform or platforms will the experiments be performed and how to analyze the data for the best monitoring results. Literature review on the rust disease detection methods for other crops such as winter wheat helped us to propose the rust disease detection methodology for switchgrass from lab-based as well as airborne hyperspectral imagery powered by machine learning with training datasets collected from ground. We collected the leaf samples that are affected by rust disease and used the lab-based benchtop system with the hyperspectral camera to scan the leaves for spectral reflectance. Our initial results from spectral data, descriptive analysis, as well as image classification achieved promising results, proving that rust diseases as one general type can be detected from hyperspectral imagery. At a later stage, we will upscale the methodology to a field skill using UEV-based hyperspectral camera and explore the feasibility of applying this method to detect different types of rust diseases. Thank you for listening, and if you have any questions, please feel free to reach out through email.